Welcome back, I'm Chegyeon, and we start off with our top stories. The South Korean national soccer team has returned from Pyongyang, where it played a World Cup qualifier against North Korea. Arriving at Incheon International Airport, team captain Son Eung Min told reporters that the North Koreans played very rough during the match, which ended in a scoreless draw, and even compared the game to a warfare. The South Korean national soccer team played its first away game in Pyongyang in 29 years. Arriving in their home country early in the morning, the team appeared exhausted. Son Hung Min said the North Korean athletes were extremely rough, and his team was lucky enough to finish the game without injuries. The soccer star added that North Korea apparently wanted the game to be held without spectators because it was aware of its team's disadvantages. Those who had a chance to watch the game said it was challenging from the start, even reminiscent of a warfare. The South Korean team's head coach, Paul Bento, said the game was suspended many times because of the North's foul play, hampering the South Korean team from fully displaying its potential. Held without spectators and the media and not broadcast live, the Pyongyang match sparked criticism around the world, with some media sources calling it the most weird match ever. The South Korean team will get together again next month to prepare for an away game against Lebanon.